Hey everyone, Merrick here. We're back in the wonderful world of Sim Airport, and it's time to make some money. That's right, buddy. We're gonna get some money up in y'all. So, what's our plan? Our plan for the money-making enterprise that we're enterprising on making is we're gonna make twenty-five thousand dollars to put another runway in. <clears throat> the runway will not be functional right away because we have to expand this area out. But essentially. What it'll allow us to do is pay for the expensive thing and then line everything up the way we need it and go from there. And highlight your passengers. All passengers are already through. We are ready for boarding in 3, 2, 1, board. 216 people minus 100. Fully loaded and ready to board. Gun done. Out to der money. <coughs> Excuse me. Coughing up a storm because I'm making so much money. <coughs> Alright, there we are. <coughs> Excuse me again. I had to clear my throat. Whew. There we go. 118. Where you at? Come on. There you go. Get out of here. Ah. So we have our offices planned. Uh, we won't do those until we get a second runway in. Just to <clears throat> expand out our ability to make money. We have our baggage system up and running. I think it can handle two runways. I don't think we need to expand it right now. So we should be good. Should be good. We'll see. If it can't, well, then we have certain investments that we have to make. Uh, don't we? Uh, uh, we do. Alright, our tiny planes coming in. They don't provide a huge boost, but you know what? They're better than nothing. Let's see. Probably start the day around 17. Maybe. Ish. Give me 400. There we go. Oh, that's right. No, we have we have two other flights after this. I forgot. We have our nighttime flights. So yeah, we should be able to go to almost $20,000 for the next morning. Oh, man. Those nighttime flights are so good. Then he's going to laser these over there. The laser delivery system is pretty badass. So we can have that connected to baggage carousels. But it can't be connected to gates. So in order to have my gate make use of that, I have to have another one hooked up and in. Shit. Alright, well, we might as well just go ahead and do that. Um, balls. Let's see, let's see, hold on, that one goes that way and out and over, so this one needs to go up here, this one needs to go out here. Okay, let's place the old baggage thing, there we go. So this is gonna this is gonna delay expansions a fair bit. Okay. Then we need to come out like this. Yeah. Cannot create an intersection. Shit. And then, too close. Hold on. Okay. We gotta get this one out of here. Uh, 
Okay. I don't have enough money. Damn it. So we're going down to there. Oh, come on. I'm so close. Shit. Let's go until we can't. Damn. Lost money on the way there. Okay. So that leaves a thousand dollars that we gotta get done. There we go. Okay, so we'll get that hooked up. And then we will get a baggage carousel there. Then they get that hooked up. And that's just, it's gonna be more time. I don't know if that worked. I mean, it seems to have. How are we doing on the conveyor lines here? Nearly done. Nearly. We need our carousel to come in. I'm going to go ahead and put the second carousel for flights. Yeah, just... Just get it in there. That way we can we can go ahead and have it working. And then we can get the 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 piping, the conveyor system in, conveyor line. I mean that's a pretty complex a little conveyor line we got going on here. You know? It's a lot of work. Well, it's sure as hell a lot of money. We want to get that installed so we can then determine where we can put our lines. Technically that's ready. But we're not going to assign a gate yet. You can only have one gate at a time, so we're going to use the second gate there. Let's go ahead and start on this. Alright. Let's go to the wall. There we go. I mean, these guys aren't going to get any rest. We've got work to do, you know? Every dollar we get is going right back into this, completing this little line here. Nope. We're in the, we're in the red. Hold up. <laughs> Construction stops because we're broke. I don't mind it. I live for being in the red. Because then when you get out of it, you're just like, Oh, damn. We got money again. Time to get the hookers and blow. Yeah. We're so broke. This is going to take forever to get out of. But tomorrow, we'll get $2,700. And be able to... Uh, finish off our conveyor system. Don't even need a full 2700. There we go. We're almost there. 
We are spending money we don't technically have. This money is all accounted for, but I don't give a damn. Done. Both of our carousels, carousels? carousels are hooked up right there to our big old hub. And they're already being used. That's fantastic. That is fantastic. Now we just have to save $25,000 up, get another gate, and then we can really make some money. Now the question is, what am I going to do for the next runway? Another one of these guys cannot connect to my gates so we're gonna have to have separate gates for the larger runways so we can have two gates and two additional runways and then this son of a bitch this is gonna cause a problem we can't intersect so this can't be a ticketing area for our new runway so we got to do a, a ticketing area here. And then we can run... Well, you can put this, like, under here? Let's get enough money together for one of these. Let's see where your limitations on placing it are. Hub specialty. What specialty hubs? I don't know what that is. Eight ports. Eight ports. I don't know what to do with that is. Alright, we gotta wait for the next day's... Ooh, hold on. I think I might have enough for a, sp a short one. Yeah. No. We gotta wait for the next day before we can actually start looking at that. We're not gonna do anything with it, of course, but we kinda wanna plan out where we're going to put things. And I'm thinking a new ticketing area built right here. Um, and then the restaurant built here and expanded out as much as we can. Storage moved down to here. You know got got ideas little plans little thought processes going on in the old brain pan first we gotta get we gotta get money okay so you can place these under underground but we wouldn't be able to put things there so technically I could have put this like closer didn't realize that. So what I'm thinking is new ticket area, large hub in here gives me routing options and um, ticketing options. Those are my thoughts at least. We may end up at moving a bunch of these guys. But that's that's future us. You trust this problem. For now, we're just going to be happy with what we're doing. And grow our little airport from one terminal to two. Alright. So now we just wait and let the money pile up. We gotta get back to 25000 Not going to be super easy. Not going to happen this episode, but I think... Going ahead and addressing the baggage issues straight away, good idea. Um, it just, it's going to lead to happiness from our people. One thing I can do is I can go ahead and buy a door and a bunch of benches. So we're just going to put a bunch of seating in. 
We might have to move some of this later. That's fine. Um, there's a big fucking door, too. There it is. I'm trying to guess. One, two, two, three, four, two, three. I'm going to say right about there is where the door is going to have to go. Which some of these benches can't be here, but we can we can move those. <sighs> Fuck it, we'll buy a door. All right, so I I kept the door, but I canceled the project. We're gonna have to build some wall here. We do need to build some windows. Eventually. So. That we can just go ahead and plop down some window here. A little bit like that. I don't think we'll put windows in the bathroom yet. Yet. Keyword there. Of course, that sets us back a little bit. I'm not worried about it. And now everybody can see out the window. Isn't that nice? I think it's nice. If they don't think it's nice, then kiss my ass. I'm literally out of money. Alright. Out of money. I'm broke again. Goddamn windows are expensive. Uh, could you get out of here, prop plane? I'm never, ever, ever going to get to where I need to be. I keep spending money like it's free or something. Come on, big plane. Get me out of debt so I can buy more windows. Because I am going to blow all my money on windows. Plenty of seating. Plenty of winders. I think we're good. Okay. So, there you go. Now we sit and wait. For $25,000. We have four hundred. Let's see how this date goes. We have 3,000. We have 2,000. I'm not rounding up or down. We got 2,000. Or I'm rounding down, sorry. We got 2,000. 2,000. And come on board. You got 30 minutes. Boom. Done. 30 minutes early. We have two grand into the day. That's not too bad. We spent a lot of money. A lot of money over the last two days. Um... We got a thousand. And people are coming in. So we're going to go to zero dollars. We're at zero dollars. Anything below a thousand is a zero dollar value. Doesn't matter. If we go negative, we're at negative dollars. Right now we're at zero. And the reason I say that is what I have right now in the bank is not enough for me to buy a single item. And right now is not enough for me to go through another hour of operations. So we have zero dollars. We have a thousand dollars. We did not go negative. That is the most promising part of this. So I'm not going to spend any money today other than what we have to spend. And by the end of the day, we're going to see how much money we end up with. We have zero dollars. Okay. We have a thousand. 
We have 3,000. 3,000 is a good amount. I mean, the sun just came up. Our red eyes are done. Our early mornings are done. We haven't had any args in freaking ages. We've been getting out early because we got our baggage system set up. People can get through security real quick. We have 3,000. We're up to four. Not a sustained four, I don't think. Although well, there's 71 people. We may be able to get these guys out of here before the uh, hour turns. Nope. Two jackholes were just standing around, costing me money. Down to three. Up to four. Gonna stay at four. Ooh, hit six. I didn't expect that. So we'll be at five when this thing takes off. It's supposed to schedule departure at. 12 that's two hours in the gate that's that's a long time in the gate we're gonna get them out of here almost uh, an hour early let's take that the earlier they're out the earlier the next flight's in the more money we have in bank so we're gonna stay at seven now we're getting everybody queued up almost a full queue before the door even opens that's beautiful We're at seven. Leaving half an hour, over half an hour early. They're out. Bumps us to eight. Ending at seven. Ooh, we're nine. If we could end the day over $10,000, it's two and a half days to, to get to 25 grand. So next episode, we could see 50 grand a day. If we can get the sim similar contracts, of course. Okay. Our two small planes, which actually cost us money to have. But I'm going to keep them. You know, they really took a risk on us. Let's go down here. How much is this office going to cost me just for the freaking basics? Foundation. $36,000. Good lord. We have to build those in baby steps. So we're going to be at 7 by the time our actual money makers get here. How much are we charging these guys to land? 680 eh, I mean, they're real small, so that's probably fair. I haven't researched price setting anyways, because we can't. 14 people. This basically covers my hourly operations for the two hours that these guys are in my gate. I'm okay with that. Next flight comes in now. We'll be at 7. No, nope, it's going to come in earlier. We're at 10, so 9. Yeah, we might be able to finish the day out at 10. We got, what, two hours without flights, I believe? three hours without flights because the next flight leaves at 10 the following flight comes in at 10 leaves at 11 so we have 1200 between 12 and 1600 dollars that's going to come out We can be at 10. A little over, maybe. There's 11. It is 30 minutes till midnight. We're at 11.9. We're at 12. So we ended the day with $11,000. So... 
another day and a half we can get in uh another runway. Yeah, I think that checks out. So it's one right now. Here comes two. We're going to start the day. So at three, we're going to be at nine. And then the next, the, the first flight should come in before we roll over I think final approach yeah so it came in f before we rolled over so first flight we came in with ten thousand dollars I don't know it's gonna be close it might actually be three full days before we can get that hmm We have a bunch of stuff already purchased for it. All we need is the gate, the gate agent um, booths, and the queue. The queue's free. The gate agent booths are money. I think they're like 500 bucks a piece, which isn't really a huge deal. I wonder, can you put these things in here? I don't see why you wouldn't be able to. Yeah, you can. So we can put like one here and one there and run the pipes that way. Oh, that's actually a pretty good idea. Because so our conveyor lines can just come straight down like this and converge over here and then our output lines can go up and around for the last two lines there and then two lines here for tickets and two lines over here for baggage claims yeah we can do that we can make that work this actually technically should have gone like this and then up like this and hugged the hangar So this should have come over here and hugged this, allowing me to have a longer line that's dipped in more. Uses more um, belts that way, but it's better for placing others. Lessons learned. It's not going to be such a huge deal. We are about to hit 20,000, though, which is pretty freaking sweet. We get the second runway in. We'll be making, what, two, three grand an hour instead of the one that we're making now. So it'd be like, I want to say two and a half, because I think we're not making a full three, but I think we're really damn close with, with fees. So 1,700, and then another four, so that's 2,300. Yeah, so uh, 4,600 for that then that would actually that would actually do a lot of good for us we'd be looking at roughly forty two hundred dollars every flight well every large plane flight these little proppy planes you wouldn't get much out of it but i might not bring any more of those in yeah we could we could do some work with that I love watching them bounce around like a pachinko ball in those things. I'm gonna make them as curvy as possible. Okay, next one's in route. They're just not worth having the tiny planes. I love them because, again, they saved my butt early on, but. And they're always good for a, a happiness boost. I mean, quick. Quick planes, quick jobs. Pretty good.
So we could probably end at 20,000, start the day just below at about 19, 18, 19. So that means next episode, runway, and or, um, gate, and everything we need. I already have a car. I already have um, the baggage carousel. Probably going to need a fuel truck soon. It's not too shabby, though. There's 19. This will pop us over 20,000. Let me make sure that it's 25 and not 20,000. Ooh, I hope it's not 22. Oh, it's 28. Okay, never mind. It's even more expensive. <sighs> that sucks. But yeah, we'll definitely be placing that gate next episode. Without a problem. Who threw trash out here? Guess there isn't a trash can, huh? We have a lot of garbage. We only pay them 25 bucks for that? That's a pretty good deal. Alright, so there's our last day. Before we put our next runway in. We gotta make $8,000. That's easy enough. That's most of the day, but we can actually do that. And get this runway in, at least purchased, before we start uh, bringing in other flights. Might not, able, might, might not be able to bring in other flights until day two of the next episode. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like. If you have any comments, suggestions, some in the comment section below. And of course, if you enjoyed this and you haven't subscribed, consider clicking that good old subscribe button on YouTube. Let you know to get fresh content out. All that being said, I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.